What's going on, everyone? It's time for another Christmas comedy film review. Yeah, it's December, so we're going to do some Christmas movies. So um, let's keep it up. Today, we're going to talk about the Christmas comedy Office Christmas Party. It was released December 9th, 2016, directed by Josh Gordon and Will Speck, who they've done other films like Lyle Lyle Crocodile, The Switch, Blades of Glory, and Distant. Uh, this had a budget of $45 million, and it was, uh, I think it was a flop when it came out, to be honest. It got, like, quite harsh reviews and things like that, so, yeah. i seen this movie once before this, and uh, I didn't really remember it, so I rewatched it yesterday. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so let's talk about it. Well, start Jason Bateman and Jennifer Aniston, and I can't remember the other guy's name, but, uh, yeah, there's a lot of famous people playing in this. So, uh, Jason Bateman is basically a... Uh, manager at this software company that's like slowly struggling and it's the holiday season so they're trying to get their biggest client to come and uh and work with them but jennifer anderson plays the evil sister of the the head of the branch and she's actually the ceo of the company now because their father passed away and uh yeah she uh is really strict no christmas party they're making cuts and trying to save as much as they can and then eventually uh yeah this client uh refuses but then they offer in a comment for a Christ their annual christmas party to uh yeah sweeten the deal and uh yeah so they slowly behind uh jennifer innocent's characters back uh they start throw this christmas party and uh it gets really out of hand <laughs> and uh eventually they realize there's more to it than what's actually going on and uh it's sort of like a film that's a um, brother sister bonding in the more business oriented world <laughs> type of film um with some crazy antics as well overall this film is really well shot um it has some good act I mean, the acting's pretty good too and overall i thought it was amusing um it definitely had the struggle points in some of the writing aspects though where uh they'd set up for a certain joke and uh yeah once they do it they execute it quick and then immediately cut to plot point movement M more scenarios to move the plot forward and it does that quite a bit like they don't just ham they don't just give you time to realize what the joke is or to for it to sink in to have full effect and uh that's a big struggle i had with this i thought uh they had some pretty good jokes but then also when they start doing fart jokes in the middle of the movie you know they're already running out of steam writing this and uh they're having trouble trying to keep it interesting and more and resort to those like lowbrow type of jokes which was uh disappointing and uh yeah overall i thought it was an amusing comedy it's not by any means like the night before or anything like that this one uh is mediocre at best and uh it had a lot of potential but um it could have done a little bit better so overall i'll give office christmas party a two it was okay at best it's not the greatest film and uh it's not like the most cheerful for christmas it gets pretty weird and wacky but uh overall it's still amusing so if you want to check it out it is on netflix at least the canadian one right now and uh, uh also uh link the trailer down below like always so you can check it out there also link down below is my instagram as well as post clips of films and review in the future all my stories you have the film title hashtag and put the title of the film in there as well and uh also link down below is my letterbox at Derek p reviews that's where i post my first my rating after watching the films and my twitter's down below as well at reviews underscore Derek. so follow me the and on those platforms stay with this channel like this video share some more people wherever comment your opinions of the film down below if you have any if you have any films or film franchises in any genre and on any stream service that you want to hear my opinions on in the future comment those down below i'll try my best to get to them as soon as i can and if i can find them also make sure you uh like this video and uh yeah like this video, subscribe. Hope we'll find something weird, obscure, and odd that you probably never thought checking out together. And also, so you hear my opinions on popular films, so come out classic films, and reviews on other things as well. And don't forget to ring that bell because we're going to start a sci fi franchise in the next review The Terminator. I've only reviewed one of them, so we got five to talk about. So we'll start with the first one. So tune in for that epic review <laughs> next time. And uh, watch out for all those crazy hooligans. Don't
uh, the company's Christmas parties and cause them a lot of damage. I guess I'll see you all in the next one. So until then, cheers. <laughs>